Hey guys, how you doing? I hope you are doing well. This is JBL Bar 2.0 Sandbar, all in one compact sandbar, powerful sandbar, compact design. This sandbar deserves your attention. You can connect this sandbar to your TV via Bluetooth, HDMI, arc, and optical cable. Optical cable is not included in the packaging, but HDMI arc cable is included. What I want to do is to show you how to hook this sandbar up to your TV. This sandbar is 80 watts audio power. Basically, this is the audio connected to my mobile phone. This is the audio with mobile. Now, what I want to do is to show you how to hook this up to your TV via optical cable. Before we do anything, first of all, you need to make sure you need to unplug the sandbar off from the power. Optical cable is not included in the packaging. This is the optical cable, so you go at the back, okay, where it's written optical. You see optical at the back, then you take the cable go in you need to get the cable if you want to connect hook this up using optical cable so you push the cable inside okay and it's in now i'm going to bring the tv that i want to use I want to hook this up with lg tv from the back of your tv you need to hook the other part of the cable to where it's written digital audio in So hook this cable to optical digital audio in. And it's in. Plug in the sandbar to the power. Then the next thing you need to do is also plug the antenna back to the TV. Then plug the TV on to the power. Now, switch the sandbar on. And when you switch the sandbar, you can see it's showing us Bluetooth. You change it to TV, so press TV for it to go to the TV, okay? Now, the next thing we need to do, we need to, we need to switch the TV on. Once you switch the TV on, then you need to go to the TV settings. It's actually connected, but you need to go to the TV settings. Go to your TV settings. Now, scroll down to the sound showing us now optical out device so this soundbar is connected and once it's connected you can only control the tv using the soundbar remote control you can increase the volume this soundbar now is connected to this tv you just need to use the soundbar remote control to increase the volume likewise to decrease the volume so this is how to hook this up to your tv what we want to do is to hook this up using hdmi cable so you take this end of the cable you go to 
HDMI out TV arc. So push the cable inside it and it's in. Okay. The other end of the cable needs to go to back of your TV. So take the other end of the cable, go into HDMI into EAC. Okay, so push it inside, it's in. Now I plug in the TV and the sand bar back on. So use the sandbar remote control, switch it on. Once you switch it on, you can see it's showing us blue color, which is Bluetooth. You need to select TV from the sandbar to, for this to change. And once it is in TV mode, it will, you will see a white light here. So now the next thing we need to do is switch the TV. And this is the audio. Once it's in HDMI cable, once it's HDMI connection, you can control it with TV and sandbar remote control. If you want to know, the next thing to do is you can go to your TV settings. So select the gear, okay, button from your TV remote control. So select the TV settings. Now I need to scroll down to sound out. You can see sound out HDMI ARC device. So this sandbar now is connected to HDMI and like I said earlier once it's HDMI you can control the volume with the two remote control so this is how to hook this up now what I want to show you is how to hook this up to your TV via Bluetooth and to do this so we need to switch off the TV and also unplug the switch of the sandbar okay unplug the cable Now, switch the sandbar on and also switch the TV on. You can see now this sandbar is on and the TV, you keep an eye, there's a light here, it's showing us a white light, okay? When you want to connect this sandbar to, t to Bluetooth, you need to use the remote control to select Bluetooth and once you select Bluetooth, it will show you a blue light here. So this sandbar now is in Bluetooth mode. Now we need to go to the TV settings. S use the gear button on your TV remote control. Select on it. And once you select on it, then you see the settings here. You need to scroll down to the sound. Scroll down to the sound. You can see this is it's showing us now TV speaker. It's currently in TV speaker. Then you need to select the sound. Okay, use the side button. Scroll to the side to Bluetooth. Okay, this is it's now in Bluetooth. You need to scroll down to look for Bluetooth device list. Select on it. And they will start to look. So now it's searching for available Bluetooth device. Okay. And you see, it picked up the sound bar. It picked up JB, JBL bar 2.0. can see from the list. Okay. So it picked up this sound bar now. So the next thing we need to do is we need to just use the tv remote control and select the center to connect and it's connecting it's connecting here we go so now you can see jbl bar 2.0 is connected now use the remote control for the sound bar and from the tv to increase the volume we haven't really got around to anything. okay and when it's in bluetooth you can also control the audio using sandbar remote control or using blue tv remote control so this is how to hook this up to your tv via bluetooth so now it's in bluetooth mode once you're done that you can use the remote control to increase the volume thank you very much indeed guys this is how to hook this up if you're happy with this 
Please do me a favor, like, share, and subscribe. It helps the channel.